From barracks to schoolroom in just three days, soldiers from 2nd Battalion, the Duke of Lancaster's regiment, have helped relocate a whole school. And the pupils are already used to arriving at their new base. I didn't really like it, but uh, when I saw inside, I really liked it. Yeah, it is fun. I really like this. I want to stay here forever. The children have been, and you can hear them in the background, uh, they've adapted incredibly to uh, coming to a military camp. Uh, they've put some of our drill to shame, uh, they've been marching over, uh, and it's great to see some of the, um, the rooms renamed. So instead of battle honours, the rooms are now named after rainbows or, uh, or small animals. So it's, all a, it's, a, it's a, great, a great experience. It's ironic, we, we spent Saturday and Sunday uh, supporting uh, emergency flooding operations uh, in Cumbria and Lancashire and then on Monday here we are um, stepping in to, to help our school but that's not what it's about, it's, it's about, it's about the children um, and it's about doing the right thing for them bearing in mind that you know, the majority of children in this school are our children. Can you make a hole with either a sharp pencil or scissors? Really Normally used for army training, this room is now being used for science. Well, I've had to carry a lot of stuff over because I, I teach a lot of science, so there's a lot of equipment to come over. But it was quite wet today, so it, was, it wasn't easy, but we got it all here. Building inspectors have closed the school for around three weeks to allow for repairs. It's historic structural damage. Our school is a, it's essentially a wooden building, which has been there for, for six, parts of it have been there for 60 years and it's obviously deteriorated. Lancashire County Council and the MOD are in plans, uh, have been in plans for quite a few years now to build this new school. And we're very close to actually building it, but at uh, the same time of this going on, the structural surveys were carried out, um, found out that actually there was a bit, you know, maybe a bit more deterioration in, in the quality of the school building. Um, so that's why we had to be closed down while they carried out further investigation. Over 90% of the pupils at Wheaton Primary are from Forces families, which may make them more adaptable than some. Now, although the classroom has moved here temporarily, the classes are exactly the same. And something that, again, is exactly the same is the weather here in the Northwest. So, is the weather up or down? And their prediction was right, but it seems the pupils at Wheaton Primary will be happy come rain or shine. Jesse Aru Phillips, Forces News at Wheaton Barracks in Preston.